On Thursday, August 24th, the Appalachian Wireless Arena appointed a new general manager. Former Director of Operations Larry Miller will now be taking on the role. With nearly 10 years of experience working at the arena, Miller is confident in his ability to provide the community with quality entertainment. Yeah, when Mr. Bowles left, uh, I, I became the interim, and I've been the interim for the past month and a half. Uh, the city made the decision yesterday to uh, fully promote me to the general manager position. And very thrilled, very thankful to the mayor and to the to the uh, commissioners for that. It's a it's a great opportunity. Been here for a while since 2014. Started off as the operations manager, then the director of operations, and then the assistant general manager. So it's been a it's been a long ride here. Are you ready for a new school year? What better way to start a new school year off right than with a new device on the network that keeps our students and teachers connected? Appalachian Wireless. Whether you need a new smartphone, wearable, or an iPad, we have your back-to-school solution. Visit AppalachianWireless.com or go into one of our 26 retail locations for our back-to-school deals that'll help you show up and show out this school year. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Miller comments on being more involved with the community through future events and charities. More big events and gatherings will be added soon. Actually, surprisingly well for, uh, for what I was expecting, and uh, I think we're going to do a whole lot more community involvement, help with more charities. Uh, you know, this building was built for the community and the whole of Appalachia, Eastern Kentucky. The future of the arena looks very, very bright. We've, uh, we've taken some trips to Nashville, uh, working hand in hand with a lot of promoters, uh, promises and confirmation of some very large shows that are coming through. So nothing stopped, everything's rolling. Uh, we're going right along with, and, and never missing a beat. And that's what we're supposed to do when a changeover happens. We just keep on going. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.